Do you ever feel like you're overwhelmed, like you just can't keep up? Things are coming at you from every direction and you don't know how to even start to move forward. Well, getting your bearings, getting your grounding may be a lot simpler than you think and that's what I'm going to show you today. When I got married, it was a lot of change for me. Not only did I gain a spouse, I gained two stepsons and two cats. And you know, at, at night, it was like at some point, each of the boys had some bad dreams. So they'd come in into bed with us for a little bit, then we'd have to carry them back. And the cats were chasing each other all night long. It felt like I'd moved into Grand Central Station. And I had moved from a much larger house that was all my space to a smaller house where nothing was my space. And I started to get really stressed. It was like I had no escape. It was um, it, it, all this stuff that I was not used to. It was a little overwhelming. And what I did to get out of it, it honestly, it did not take a lot. I got up around six anyway. And usually my spouse got up at that time and you know, we, we were getting ready and so on. But what I started doing was I got up at 5.45, just 15 minutes early. And there was a leather recliner that I had brought from my home. And what I did is I went and sat in that. I didn't do any formal meditation. I just sat in that. For those 15 minutes, the cats weren't allowed to come to me. This was my space. I was able to breathe, connect with myself, recenter myself. And again, it wasn't any formal meditation that I needed to do, but it was just to have that space that was mine for 15 minutes. And that little anchor is all I needed to get my bearings and build the new life that I had. It, was, you know, again, it's not rocket science. I can say that. I'm a rocket scientist. It's sometimes the simplest little thing. So if you are feeling overwhelmed, the key is not to make huge changes or that you need, you know, to run away for an hour or two, or this or that. Where can you find five minutes or 10 minutes or 15 minutes where you can just sit don't have to think, don't have to meditate or anything formal. Just sit and breathe where you can push the rest of the world away and just be there. And you will be amazed at how much of a difference that can make. Now, what I'd like to hear is other strategies that you've used or found that can help you get that sort of grounding and, and, and certainty. So if you'd like to uh, drop down into the comments below and share, it'd be great to find out and have a real conversation about other simple strategies. And they are often simple for getting our bearing, for getting our grounding.